for all the vegans who watch me as you can see fresh organic bananas so we're in banana country with the right altitude within the foothills of Kili uh, where you can easily grow a banana because it's uh, the water and the ground holds a lot more moisture uh, than what it does in Uchira for example so everywhere you turn people are growing bananas but not necessarily the ones you get back home because a lot of people grow the green variety here uh, the reason being you boil them like potatoes and they're easier to store you can keep them in storage for a long time uh, you've got to remember when you've got sun and no refrigerator for all it's a nice idea that we would all live in the tropics and eat nothing but fruit for the raw vegans as I used to be one um, when it comes to practicalities really difficult to store raw fruit in a place like Tanzania uh, without a fridge first of all obviously because it spoils but the next thing is wildlife everything I often say to people from a distance things look really good so living in the tropics and picking your own fruit looks great but it's a bit like a star from a distance you can look at it gives you a feeling of spiritual warmth but when you get up close you're going to get burnt and it's a whole big ball of burning gas and molten rock it's the same when you come to the tropics to live you have this idea that I used to have that you can just come and pick your own fruit and you can live off fruit forever but as I say when you're in the tropics like this you share your environment with wildlife and it only starts with the ants and then it moves on <laughs> to the insects and then it moves on to the rats and then it moves on to the snakes before you know it you're in big trouble on every level so but look at all these bananas Red banana. Those things are so sweet, so sweet. You know, if you're if you're a big fan of the raw vegan thing, fruitarian, um, and you're a fan of bananas, as most people are who are on that sort of uh, lifestyle, I want to say a diet. I know it's frowned upon dietary lifestyle. Um, if you come here, you will absolutely adore um, the food situation because even in Uchira five minutes drive from where I am I have a friend uh, who has a banana plantation with 26 breeds of banana 26 different types and they all taste different you, all of them taste different um, and they are natural here you can see that because you get the rare occasion where you can find a seed inside your bananas um, Especially in the little ones, you find a lot of little seeds inside the bananas, actually. So, something for you to think about in the West, you never do see them. In fact, I've seen the Cavendish factory um, going to great lengths to try and find a seed from the bananas on a documentary before. So. Making me hungry, actually. 